I'm your best friend, Chopsicle the dog, and these are the most satisfying animations. So this ring keeps getting smaller as it bounces around. And then the minute it can't get any smaller, another ring takes its place. That's really cool. It's just going to keep building up like that. Why is this so satisfying? I think for me, it's the anticipation of that spot at the end where it's going to go like and just like hit really quickly before finally securing itself in place. But if you find this satisfying, tell me in the comments below why. What's satisfying about it to you? All right, we're going to have another one here. This is a ball bouncing around inside of a circle. It says the ring gets faster until it fills the entire circle. And the ring they're talking about, I'm sure, is that one in the middle. I love the way it's, I think it's basically an eraser. Like they've got this color in the background. They covered it with black ink. And then they've basically just got a bouncing eraser that's erasing the black ink. That's so cool. And by faster, what that really means is it's going to help it bounce higher and it's going to help it reach the entire circle. This one, like the anticipation, like how is it going to get to that, to those parts that it hasn't already hit? And like, will it take an hour or will it be done like in a minute? <laughs> oh, it's going so much faster now. Oh, come on, bounce back the other direction. It is. Well, now it's going to get it in no time. Glad it didn't go the other way. It would have taken a lot longer. <laughs> okay, so these are triangles who continue to grow until they fit perfectly. I'm not sure what they mean by fit perfectly yet, but they do hit. Wow, they hit because of the right angles of the square. They actually do bounce like perfectly together and they keep meeting in the middle and I think that's the most satisfying part about it. Oh, I get it. The triangles, since they're getting bigger, eventually they're all going to just form a square that fills this entire box. So it's not really about the trail that they're leaving behind. It'll literally just be those triangles in the end. I've noticed something really cool. It's leaving a design in the middle um, where it literally hasn't even touched that circle until now. And there it is. <laughs> okay, so we've got another ball inside a circle, but now the border can't get any smaller a new border appears. Oh, when the border can't get any smaller. So this is leaving a trail by the ball, but it's erasing that trail as it gets smaller until that becomes the ball. It's like an infinite loop. I guess it's not infinite because our computers, uh, computer screen can only get so big, but it's infinite until <laughs> it reaches screen capacity probably. That's so cool. It kind of sounds almost like a, um, like maybe like a Japanese or Chinese music or something. I'm not sure which. Don't hold it against me. I'm not an expert on those. But like something you'd hear in some kind of like a martial arts movie or something. Like it's making its own music. <laughs> I love it. Oh, now it's happening faster because the the circle in the middle has gotten so much bigger. 
Wow, these really are the most satisfying animations, I think, on the internet. If you know of any others, feel free to link them. I'll do a, I'll do a uh, reaction to those as well. Oh, so very similar to what we had with the square and the triangles. This is now, I don't know what you call those shapes. Um, they're kind of like triangles. They're like well, oh, wedges, I think. So you've got these wedges or these pie pieces that are one fourth of a circle. And they're going to keep getting bigger again until they eventually fill the entire circle. I wonder if AI would be like, this is my favorite band. Listen to that music. <laughs> and again, we've got that same thing going on with the circle in the middle. Like I'm obsessed with just looking to see if they're going to crush that circle at some point. But so far, they're avoiding it almost completely. <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> Now, don't forget to tell me in the comments which of these animations was your favorite. I think so far, the circle that was erasing um, the black ink might have been my favorite. Oh, they're starting to chip away at the circle in the middle. Now, after we uh, react to this together, Feel free to go back and watch it with the sound turned off. If you ever wanted to get just the vibe of it, just all by itself, no sound, no nothing, just the image itself. And I wonder if that is also satisfying. So this square will keep stacking until they fill the whole border. Oh, and then another one starts in the middle. So the first one was a border. Oh, this one is too. So I'm seeing kind of a theme with these. It's like it's it's progressing in some way. And maybe that's part of the satisfaction. That you know that it's going to come to an end at some point. And you're waiting to watch it happen. What these do remind me of, though, and this is how we know it's truly satisfying. The... Um, the screen savers from the old like DVD players and stuff would actually bounce around like this and everybody would be waiting to see if it would ever hit like perfectly in the corner. <laughs> that one was pretty close actually. And uh, there's actually a video online of the screen saver at like a music festival or something or a film festival. I'm not sure which. And then it finally hits in the corner and the entire audience goes nuts. <laughs> it was pretty awesome. That was so satisfying. As always, I left a link to the original in the description. I've got merch down in the description. And don't forget to tell me I'm a good boy by subscribing and liking the video.